this video, you can see the ball is on the left side of my hips. Okay? So, we're going to do the diagonal ball twist. So, it we have to do the on the top of my shoulder, on the right side. So, you have to hold the ball. Go from the left side of my hips. Going to the right shoulder. This is what we call the diagonal ball twist. You have to do this at least 20 times and from the position original position going to the shoulder again and again until you're done Doing the tricep curl, I prefer to see it. As you can see, I have to lift up the ball from sitting position with my both hands. I need to do it upward. Then I have to do it. I have to bend my arm and almost the elbow almost touching each other and this how we do the tricep curl so you really have to do that for you to strengthen your muscles as you can see look at my muscle i have to do the tri triceps this is my side view on how i do the triceps curls and actually doing this kind of exercise you really have to use the medicine ball since i only have this kind of ball that i use for my volleyball basketball and other activities for this pe so i really have to pretend that it's really heavy because medicine ball has a weight this is how we do the ball race and i prefer to sit down again and I have to hold the ball with my both hands upward and I have to lower my arms forward with straight arms down to shoulder level as you can see and I have to hold it for three seconds and raise back up and you can actually do this for 20 times also This is my side view on how I do the ball race. Again, doing the ball race, you have to hold the ball for at least 3 seconds. And that's the time you have to pull up again and count another 3 seconds. This time, what we're going to do is the single arm ball race. And right now, I'm doing it with my right hand. And later on, later on I'm going to show you how I'm going to do it with my left hand as a single arm ball race. Also, just like ball race, you have to count at least three seconds and upward and go back to your position with your shoulder level and at least you have to do it for 20 times
right now what I'm doing is holding the ball with my left hand as I'm performing the single arm ball raise as what I've said and doing the ball raise you have to do it 20 times it means that when you use your left hand you have to do it with 20 times with three pause okay on your left shoulder with at least three seconds as well as your right hands is it means that you really have to do it 20 times on your left hand and 20 times with your right hands with each time you pause you have to do it with your both hand and do it with it different times for at least three seconds i hope this is clear well congratulations to you in advance